no such thing as a perfect person, only perfect intentions, right? Yes! But your record's perfect, right? Yes! Oh, tonight that makes you perfect! My buddy Joe, um, first of all, you got to know Joe, and if you didn't know Joe, you knew Joe, because Joe touched the hearts and souls of so many people in our community. What can I say about Joe? We've coached together for a number of years at A Squad. Uh, I guess some of the things I remember naturally, the hugs that uh, took your breath away, literally. In the beginning, when I first met him, I introduced myself and I told him that I lived up the street from him. And right away, you know, he gave me a big hug and you feel really comfortable, like, you know, who's this guy? You don't even know he gives you a big hug. So I want to say I met Coach Joe. Uh, he coached my son back in 2012 when uh, BBYC had, it was in its second year of existence and uh, the guy was always a, a charm to be around, you know? Uh, and the thing I remember most about him is he, like, always had a hug for you. The black Mad Max wagon that he used to come with to the games and practice, it was always great. You know, like if you knew him for one day, you had one conversation with him, you know, he had a hug for you, you know, every other time for the rest of your life that you ever saw. He was an unbelievable coach. He loved the kids. I mean, loved them. From coaching on C Squad and hugging the little kids to giving man hugs to the guys on A Squad. He was always hugging them because he cared about them. Uh, just the way he treated people. The way he treated the kids, you know, he always, he always had a, a smile for Joe. He was always really interested in what was going on with you. You know, the first time I ever laid eyes on Coach Joe, he was walking on uh, on the field at the, the Leisure, uh, and you know, we had all the Oakland Raider garb on. It's the first day of training camp, middle of the summer, and you know, he's decked out in Oakland Raider gear. So he was always a colorful guy. Uh, the players all loved him. Uh, they loved to be around him. Uh, you know, he always had a hug for you, and he was just a genuinely great human being. First time I was ever at a, d a diner with him, uh, he ordered food, and the waitress went away because she thought he ordered food for the whole table, it was just for him. He always just made you feel comfortable, and I didn't know him well enough to, you know, to uh, get the experience to coach with him, like all the other guys. I wish I did, so. I mean, if anything, I just miss him. That's not the best thing I can say. I miss you, touched the lives of so many people. And one thing that I think anyone would say, if you knew Joe for a lifetime or you knew him for a minute, you could sincerely say, Joe was the best guy you ever met. He'd probably say, what the hell are you doing that for? <laughs> you know, why are you making a video of me? You know? Because there was, there was never a big deal bigger than no, him. He was no, just him, he right? Was just, Joe was just Joe, and that made him bigger than life one of the best people I've ever met in my life. You sheltered me from harm Kept me warm Kept me warm You gave my life to me Set me free Set me free The finest years I ever knew For all the years I had with you
Just to touch you once again. 